what's up everybody welcome back and we're continuing our casual playthrough so this one <laughs> not the other one the other one is my pvp so yeah level 90 now in my casual playthrough um oh yes okay cool yeah i remember where we are we're in the sewers here and actually i wanted to maybe go down that ladder? But now I just realized, actually, wait, there's a ladder right here as well. Let me just check what's up there. Here. I'm gonna throw on the lantern. Oh, that was close. Okay, that guy saw me. Wait, what? How do I get up there? I actually just wanted to get that item. Mm, you probably have to drop down from above. I guess it wasn't here yet. Or maybe this is the way that I came from? Yeah, this looks like where I came from, because I remember... I remember this... this thing. Where the water stops, and then there's this grate, and then a bunch of rats, and yeah. Okay, well... Then, I guess that's useless. Whatever. Warped Axe. <laughs> well, no stamina. Right. I could rest, but it doesn't really make any sense yet. I'm gonna go just here. Maybe this guy doesn't see me. Okay, cool. Let's check out what's down here in this this part of the um Oh god, okay, yeah. This part is <laughs> gonna be much longer. All these pipes and monsters. Oh. See you there. This would be really scary if this was real life, like you're in the sewers with these pipes that are so high above ground with slippery moss all over, I guess. And these little creatures. Oh no. Another one. And another. Where are they all coming from? Grab this item here if I can. Somber 6. Nice. But, yep. I don't need any more. Somber, oh no, just normal smithing stone 7. Nice one also. Could be useful. Oh. Didn't see you there, big boy. Oh, 
You got me. Up against the wall. Damn it. <sighs> okay, now I have to go all the way back here. I Maybe mean, I can just run past the little creatures. Oh man. Yeah. Just ignore the fat boys and just jump down here real quick. Plop. Maybe I can even just run past them. Yeah. They don't seem too bad. Oh. Okay, that one was aggressive. There's one that throws stuff at me. But yeah, that's it. Oh, okay, this one followed me. Fine. Kill him off. Oh, wow. I can buff up. Oh, whoa, whoa. What is all this here? Pretty, uh, pretty crazy here. Okay, that leads back to the bonfire. So this is the other side. Okay, that's good to know. But there's still all the pipes and stuff down there to explore. And also, this looks so suspicious. I guess I'll go back down to the pipes and you know, deal with these little creatures. What's it say? Hidden wall? Yeah. Good one. Didn't see that one coming. Oh, there's a pipe here that you can drop down onto. But now I'm curious to see where this goes over here. Oh, that's a lot of enemies here. Careful. Maybe I will drop down on this pipe. Yeah. Oh, he f actually made it. There's a crab thing crawling around down there. A lobster, I mean. I think he saw me. Let's see if he just walks away. No need to fight him. But... Oh, okay, he's leaving. What? Oh man, another one? Yep. So just gonna ignore them if possible. Some somber stones. Moak shackle. Oh wow. Normally you can buy that from um what's his face? From patches. Oh, this one's aggressive. Well, now you can't get me in here. Oh, Another somber smithing stone. Let's go the other way, past this lobster. Ow. Oh. Did I get it? I got it. Um, huh? There's nothing down here. Oh, shit. At 
Leave me alone, you evil lobsters. Huh? Wait, then, what am I supposed to do down here? Oh, shit. Oh, I thought there was a door for a second. I'm gonna get sprayed to death, probably. Oh, here's a hole in the wall. Nice. Oh, with a bonfire. Well, well, what do you know? Might as well rest, I ran out of potions. <laughs> Let me see if I can level up also. Oh, just 5,000 off. So, yeah. There's no point. To, you know, try to grind that out if I have the, the runes thing. So, yep, 58. So close to the hard cap now. Let's go this way first. Oh, it's an elevator. Okay, nothing below. Pull it, yep, okay. And on this middle floor there, probably also nothing really. Okay, while well, it's coming back down. We can actually see what's down here. Maybe there's like a locked door. I'm guessing there's the boss just here, but it's going to be locked. Yeah, there is a door. Yep. There's probably a boss behind it. Huh? Some zombies or whatever. I will go back to the elevator as well. I just wanted to see what's this way first. Oh, shit, there's a fire thing there. Ghost glove work. Mushroom. Oh, hold up, hold up. See, like this, it looks like it's a road leading to a wall, but actually there's nothing there. Oh man, I have a bad feeling about that this thing is... Oh, okay, it stopped. Why is this guy so dumb? Look, he's just trying to walk into it. Oh wow, you have to be really fast. One, two. Oh shit, too early. Couple of dead zombies here. Frostbite. Grave glove wart. Okay, number nine. It's almost the ultimate. Flower in the center. Sometimes also there's... Okay, no. Not here. 
There would be like torches or something, I think. Okay, and there's nothing on this guy. So we can run and jump and land here. Grave Glove Word 8. Okay, a bunch of zombies coming out. I have no idea if this is the right way or the wrong way or which way. Wait, I didn't even pull the lever though. Why is this door open? Something suspicious here. Yeah, okay. Cleaver. Yo, this is really weird because uh, this looks almost like a boss room. Hmm. Is the bonfire just here? <laughs> Wait, what? Poisoned. Oh, I don't have. Uh, what a shame. There was no lever or anything in here, right? Oh, I nearly missed the item. Oh, I'm so dumb. Why can I not craft? Damn it. Now I'm poisoned. Ah, that's annoying. Poison lasts very long. Maybe I can offset it a bit with this one. I don't know if I have the HP regenerating stuff in it. annoying. I think it was here already. Yeah, that statue, right? We saw that already. There was the fire thing here. Wait, what? Now the fire thing is down? This is one of those times where you can hit the fire thing and then jump on it. Yep. Takes you to a higher level. Okay, a tunnel here and some kind of altar. Yo, these ruins are really big this time. Easy backstab, hopefully. Yup. And then. Oh! Whoops. Come here. Well, obviously don't want to jump down there. Drink another one. Oh no, I'm dead, right? Oh no. Whoops. That was deeper than I thought. I don't know why I jumped down. So stupid. So stupidly. Oh, there's a guy here. Good. Sacramental bud. Oh, and a lever. That might be the lever for the door. Let's see. Somewhere heavy door. Yep, awesome. Okay. Now the only problem is how do I get back to the 
bonfire from here. I'm co I'm very confused. Maybe it was just here this way. Let me check. I think this was one of the first rooms with the guy spitting. Yeah, here's a door. Let's see if there's the bonfire right here. Ah, good, 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 good. Oh man, so confusing. There's still the elevator as well, which I want to check out. But first, let's do the boss. Before we get totally lost. <laughs> yeah, okay. Here we go. All buffed up. And... What do we have here? A wizard? Oh. And his two dogs. Oh, his two Scarlet Rot dogs, or Bleed dogs. Okay. Oh, shit, he killed me. Oh, look, he only had, like, one HP left. Uh, it's frustrating. Oh, it's an old man. Looks like Santa Claus under there. <laughs> With the white beard. Oh, shit. That was really close. If it wasn't for those stupid dogs. Okay, we'll get him this time. Maybe I'll focus the dogs first instead of the Santa. Oh man, he's really fast compared to his doggies. Okay, I killed one of them off right away. Number two. Oh, he's casting this fucking stuff. Oh man, I'm out of stamina. Shit, I gotta heal. Yeah. Oh, blood loss. Maybe back here. Yeah. There we go. Esgar. Priest of blood. Good fight. Lord of Blood's Exaltation. What's that? Blood loss and vicinity increases attack. Oh yeah, this is very good for bleed builds. Because if you bleed. Or the enemy bleeds, it just does more and more damage, I think. Hold on, let me get the hell out of here. Uh, there's no need to warp. Or, well, to save time, I could warp. T okay, it's fine. I have 30,000 souls. Oh, did I pick up my... I didn't pick up mine. Oh, whoops, whoops, whoops. Yeah, I died in the corner here. Okay, let's just warp back out, I guess. Fourth... 43. Okay, 43,000. I'm guessing I probably need around like 5, 6 to level up again. 50. Oh, 7. Okay. Almost 7. 6,100 something. So, do I have 7? 5. Oh, I can use two of these and one of the other. Good enough. I don't care anymore because, like, I'm getting pretty high level, so it's harder and harder to level up. Okay, very cool. One more level and then we're done with Vigor and we can just keep going with Intelligence forever. Even though it doesn't give us that much, but 80 is the hard cap, so... Wait, where was the elevator now? Okay. There's nothing below it. There seems to be nothing there. We can check on the way down, I guess. Some ghosts. Okay. I have no idea how difficult they are, so... Oh, they're very easy. Oh, another one. Oh, they just keep respawning. I'm not getting any souls to kill them. 
Alright, fine, just leave him there. No point fighting and trying to kill something that you can't. There's a lever here. Oh, this is opening. Oh, shit. Oh, man. Oh, it's just a shortcut back to the other bonfire. So I might have actually explored now pretty much almost everything here. If I'm not mistaken. I could just double check. Um, I think it would be faster if I just warp to the other one. Let me see what it's called. Was it this one? It's probably faster just to warp to the other bonfire and just pick up the souls that way. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Powerful. And was there anything else up here? Not really. There's the shortcut down. Alright, so I'm pretty much done checking that whole area, I think. I'm gonna go now and check. Oh, there's still this door. Can I open from this side? Uh-huh. Hmm. Let me drop down this again. Maybe there's some pipes or something. Oh yeah, there's still... Also, there's above here. There's stuff above me. Maybe there's a ladder somewhere. To get up there? I don't know. Interesting. Yeah. Hmm. Oh yeah, I can run and jump across probably. That looks like I didn't go that way yet. There's one right here as well, but maybe he just leaves me alone. Wait, what? How? How should this be even possible? There's pipes above me. Uh-oh. Gang squad here. in sight. Ow! This knife guy chucking stuff at me. Hold on. So there's this jingling like there's a scarab nearby. Well, going down is easy. Oh yeah, maybe... Maybe I didn't really explore here enough. Could this be a ladder? Where? <laughs> what? What do they mean, even? Hold on, hold on, hold on. There was the guy, yep, just hiding there. But wait, this just leads you back here, huh? What? This is confusing. So I'm not sure how I'm supposed to do this. Grab the bonfire if I can. Perhaps... 
this way. That jump down that leads just in a big circle. Uh, down here's all the pipes and stuff, if I remember correctly. Let's check out what's over here then. There's a door here. Oh yeah, I haven't gone this way yet. This looks promising. Let's backstab this guy. Oh, shit. He kicked his body over the edge. Uh... Huh? No, too high. Oh, I know. Sometimes you can jump off the edges here. Wait, let me see. Maybe at the top. Or like here. Sometimes there's ledges below. Yeah, this looks like you could almost make that one. Let me just, let me just double check it, though. Or here. Yeah, okay, this is, this is the way. Oh, and there's a beetle. Somber 6, nice. But again, useless for me since I'm already maxed. Oh, shit. String. Does it? Oh shit, there's a flower here. Okay, I don't want to get poisoned again. Okay, one shot flower. Pretty easy! Okay, there's a flower right there. Let's go kill this one. Should find this cookbook to make um, antidotes. Funny how the little ones can move around. Oop. Well, big flower. Hmm. Miranda powder. Preserving boluses. Great. One of these guys. Okay, let's try a jump attack. Oh no. More than one. I do have the ones that prevent the blight stuff. Does not open from the side. Great. Oh, man. Always the same. Oh, hold up. He's, he's faced the other way, I think. Yep. Why does it have to be these lizards? Also, there was this ladder with all the plants. Maybe I should go back at some point. But let's see where this leads us first. Oh, it's this guy. Let's get a little bit closer. One more should... Yup. Very good. That might kill him. Yep. 
Oh, another omen cleaver. Now I got two of them. Damn. Maybe it's like pretty high drop chance or something. Oh wait, let me see if there's... Up, grace ahead. Okay, yeah, maybe... Maybe, maybe they're not lying for once. Other players, you know, trolling. Not that I really need a grace just yet. I'm doing okay-ish. Okay, there's a pipe here with... Is that an enemy? Yeah, there's some kind of enemy there. Oh, now I'm on the... Okay, now I'm on the higher level of the pipes. Uh, and there's a door here. Is this the door that leads to the bonfire? Let's see. That would be awesome. Then we could make a shortcut, at least. Awesome. Okay, cool. Perfect. So just in case I die and stuff, it's very easy to get back here. And I assume we should go up. Yeah, I'm getting... Hey. Wow. Great. Blood lost. There's no way you can jump that. Okay. Oh, I see. It's drop down. But which side? Here's also okay, I right? think, right? <laughs> Not today, you little sneak rat. Man, these guys, they're so small, but they do so much damage over time. Did he just... he just suicide him? No. Oh, he's there. Great. So that led to nothing. That was that was pointless. Well, that was close. I almost fell down. The sewers are like super complicated to navigate. Actually, kick the ladder. Oh, nice. Okay, shortcut. I guess. Here you can jump into the pipe at the top, it looks like. Okay, let's see what's over this way first. Oh my god, this place is so huge. So complicated. Oh, cool. Should have probably first drank the blue. Oh well. Yeah, I knew it. There we go. Wow, plus three? Not bad. Another blue one. Level eight golden rune. And a dead end. And I still remember, like, there's still the path with the plants that I didn't go. I have to check that later. And also, I'm wondering if I'm missing a path here now. I think there was another path down here. But, yeah, we can always go back. Huh?
Wait, is this a new area, or is this just leading me back? This looks like it's just leading me back to where I was before. Is he alive? Yeah, he's alive. Okay, hmm. <laughs> he didn't know I could stab the sword through. Oh, there's the lobsters down there. Yeah, I think this is the same area. So, I don't see any items. So that means I've probably already been here. I'm not going to jump out because I don't want to. I'm going to go back and see if there's another path here. Wait, which way did I come from? Oh my god. Bro. Okay, this is a dead end, so obviously not that way. <laughs> oh, man. I don't remember which way I came from. Oh, there's so many paths here. Shit. Wait, let's try the door first, because it's easy to remember. And then I come back through the door and take the one on the right. I have a feeling this is where I jump down. No, there's something here. Mm. A rat. What the hell? Oh my god, man. Oh no! I fell. Oh, we were here before. Yeah, with the lizards. Whoa, look at this. <laughs> man, he's glitching out. That's so funny. It's like breakdancing into the pipe itself. So, hold on. Wait, what? Where am I now? Oh, I'm back here? Huh? Wait. There's a ladder there. I can just climb back up and go in the pipe again. But I th think it's all connected, actually. The ladder, the pipes. Because these lizards, I just killed these lizards. So... Okay, let's find that door that I went through and then take the path on the right. But this was not the door now. Oh my god, I'm so confused. You have no idea. Wait, what? Now we're back here? Uh... Alright, you know what? Let's do this area first. And then we can go back into that pipe. Because I'm so confused. Oh, shit. Lizards. Maybe we can kill them from up here. I don't know if the... The beam attack will reach that far. No. Oh, man. I missed all three of them. Oh, shit. Maybe I just run past. Screw it. Oh, there's an item back here. Poison stone? Whatever. Oh man, I don't want to die from these lizards. Oh god. Come on. Oh shit, I ran out of... Um, what's it called? Oh no, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Man. Too many. Nomad ashes. Looks kind of high. I probably will die if I jump down there and here. Or maybe... Huh? There's a lot of bloodstains. It looks like 
people tried jumping down here and then they all failed and died. Yeah, this is like super high. Why would you... No. No, it's not that way. Also here. I can't get a good angle. It's also super high up. And here? Uh-uh. Can I jump on this? Yeah. Oh, fuck. It's slippery. So, this is like a dead end, I guess? Oh, do people actually try to attempt that? Like, no way. There's no way you can do that. So this is a dead end with the plant? Oh, there was one thing I just thought of. There could be um, a secret wall there. Let me first kill this. Poison blue Miranda powder. Okay, cool. What? So this was all just one big dead end. Okay. Good to know. Very nasty. A bunch of those lizards and the uh, flower. Okay, what I'm going to do is jump into the... Uh, into the thing from the top again. Was it this way? Yeah, I think it was this way. Just climb up the ladder, you know? Man, this area is confusing. Very confusing. Oh, didn't make it. Bloop. Behind was a dead end, I think. Wait, let me just double check it again. Sorry, I don't remember. I don't know the way. So. There's a way up and a way here. Let's Let's do up real quick. Oh, yeah, I think this was before where I was like, oh, let's go to the right and see what's it. Okay, we, I think we did everything else. Let me go this way and then take the other path. So this goes down, and then there's this path here to this way. Oh, shit, and this splits as well. Um, let's go this way first. On the way back, it's the one on the right then. Uh-huh. Oh! An item. So we didn't go this way yet. No. No, 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 no. Nice. Oh, shit. There we go. Nice. Three more potions, you know. Just in case I come across a boss or something soon. Smithing stone eight. Dead end. Dead end. Okay, so this is all dead end, but at least I got some potions out of it. Oh, and then, yeah, we can check it up dead end as well. I said when we go back, there will be a path on the right. Where this body was. Yep, yeah, this one, I think. Okay, good. We weren't here, obviously. So, okay, another item. 
Eye of Yilu. Yilo. And a dead end. Hmm. Uh, shit. <laughs> oh, dead end here. I guess then I will go right when I get out of here. Because that's dead end. That's a dead end. Let's go this way. Uh, huh. Let's go up. Oh, wait. We did this already, right? This was also a dead end, I think. Okay. Hmm. Fine, let's go down. This way. Oh, and this leads us back to the room with the lobsters. So I guess that's everything, right? I mean, there is nowhere else to go. Here in these sewers. I think that's it. Now, I think I've explored everything in the sewers. But I didn't find, um, what's his face? The dung eater. So, oh well. Let's just leave it. We'll go back now to, like, the normal main game. Goodness, the sewers are, like, complicated. Like, very complicated. Ah. Okay. So... One thing I never got was the Bolt of Grand Sacks. I can go get that real quick. I think it's this way. I was even talking about it in the other videos. Like, oh, yeah, yeah, I'll go get it, I'll go get it. And I forgot to get it. I'll fight the knight after I kill these two guys. Oh, it's delayed. Right. Okay, easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Oh shit. Not good. Now they're all going to be coming for me. If I can kill this bitch. Okay, good. The Bolt of Grand Sacks is just above me. So, I need to go up the stairs here somewhere. Yep, here. It's way easier if you just clear out the area first. Foot soldiers? No. Okay. So now if I screw up, I don't think anyone's going to be trying to kill me. <sighs> you have to run and jump here. This is the wrong way to get the Bolt of Grand Sacks, but whatever. Whatever works, you know. And then you can go this way. Normally there'd be, like, archers and stuff over there shooting at you, so... Yeah, you might have to be fast if you don't kill the enemies like I did. 
And ta-da! One of the coolest weapons in the game. But, yeah, you need lots of dexterity. 20 strength, 40 dex, I think. Oh. It's a spear. It's one of the best spears in the game. 20 strength, 40 dex. And it scales, I think, with dex once you start to upgrade it. So, yep, it's a really cool weapon. I like it. I like it very much. Well, I think the thing that sells the Bolt of Grand Sacks, once you've, you know, gotten the stats, is um, this super long-ranged capability of it. It's almost like a sniper rifle. I could actually switch to it. It's kind of a fun weapon. But then I would have to, again, respec. But that's actually not such a big deal. I think I have, like, eight of those things. Let's see how many I have. Of these Laravel tiers, you know? Oh, I have, like, five of them. Okay, whatever. And actually, it's more or less would be the same exact stats that I have right now. Except instead of putting 55 into intelligence, I would have to put like 55 into dex. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> but it is a fun weapon. I like it a lot. If I get bored of the Moonblade, I might switch to it. Yeah, I was here already. I remember I got the items there. So, we're almost ready to go up to the boss. I believe... I believe I pretty much got everything. And I got the items there too. Um, so. Okay, yeah, let me warp back to this avenue thing, whatever. This one. And. Yeah. 51. Okay, probably by the next bonfire. This part could be a little bit tricky because of all the archers and stuff. If you want to get all the items, then yeah, you should probably clear these guys out. I think I will even buff here because these dudes can be a real pain in the ass. Okay, he's just luckily standing for us here to backstab. And the other guy also. Oh, man. Oh, shit. Oh, man. Okay, just quick R1s, I guess. Oh, man. The other guy interrupted me. R2. Yep. Oh man, come on. Okay. Oh, that was the archer. Okay, but then this next part is easy. Now it's easy to get all the items once you kill them all. Um, especially that archer with the great bow who shoots lightning arrows at you. Oh, what? A <sighs> so many guys just sitting around doing nothing here. So... Okay, I got all the items here. Oh yeah, there is an alternative route. But as you can see... Oh, can I kick this down? Yeah, you can, you can come from this way as well. I think I was already here. This is where the sewers and stuff are. The first sewers. Yeah, I think I was here already. So, in theory, you could avoid all those knights and stuff if you came from that way, and then you have to just climb up this giant-ass wing. 
It's huge. Jump, jump, jump. That's why it makes sense maybe to kill even the archer, because he's just going to be shooting at you. But as long as you're sort of moving and jumping, most likely he will miss. And then, you know, there's the wing here and stuff. And the other the part of the wing that's, like, connected, I guess, to his body. You can climb up this. And warp. Jump down. Gravel stones, whatever. Jump up here. Ooh, a rune arc. And there's a knight at the top of these stairs, which I guess we can try to kill. With a backstab. Maybe not yet. Let me get up a little bit higher. Yeah, here he is. He will do this, like, lightning stab thing with his spear. Easy. And then here is a guy. Maybe I can hit him through the wall. Oh, no, I cannot. Oh, man. Enough joking around. Bonfire. Yep. Time to level up. Nice. We finally got the 60. I think there's a rapier guy down here somewhere. This little assassin guy with the crossbow and the rapier. Let's see if we can find him. Or maybe not. Um. Oh, I only have a thousand souls, so it's good. There is a sort of boss down there, I think. What's oh, a bunch of soldiers? So what we can do is jump onto the roof. Oh, gotta dodge this knight. Whoa, look now he's shooting against the thing. Okay, we got him. Oh shit. <laughs> Knock back. What? It can go through the roof? That's pretty cheap. Shit. Shit. Come on, die. There we go. Oh, man. Oh, that does a lot of damage. There we go. I wonder if this was the crossbow guy. Oh, uh, not crossbow, great bow guy. Yeah, I think it was. He jumped down. He was like, okay, enough. I can't hit him with the bow. So I'm going to just take him out up close. But, yeah, that was his mistake. we have here just a gravel stone whatever can I oops frustrating <laughs> You have to really, like, just tap the button. See, like, if you tap the jump button and hold it, he also jumps, but maybe it's delayed or something. Nice. This time I made it. Smithing stone six. Sword sword key is always good. Sto um, stone sword key, I mean. <sighs> Great. Let me see what else there is around here. Let's check out these barns. Or stables or whatever they're supposed to be. Yeah, we came from there. Yep, a big church. Or 
I don't know, meeting hall. Oh, cool, like wizard clothes, I think. Alber, Alberish? Alberish, what was it? Alberish pointed hat. Sounds kind of German, like a German name. Alberish. Okay. They really went hardcore with the European uh, fantasy castle stuff in this game. I love it. I mean, I'm not complaining at all. But yeah, it's based very heavily off of German, French, English types of castles, you know. I've been in castles like this before, visiting them, you know. It's really cool. Oh, he's just chilling. Was there a message? Someone put a message here? Yeah. No physical ad. <laughs> okay. Oh, that's just out of reach. Wow, this is really nice. Two Fingers Prayer Book. It's probably spells. Black Key Bolt. Black Key Bolt. Esta soup. Just kidding. Ah, uh, dog. They're cooking dog? Could be. Look at that. You, you can... Just for fun, you can do, like, pointing upwards like this. Look, messages. And put, like, could this be dog? Could this be a... Where's dog? You know? And then when someone comes here and reads the message, they'll see it, like, pointing towards the meat. <laughs> That's so sick. <laughs> okay. So, that's actually puzzling. Maybe there's another way to get from up there, you know, down to here. So, I guess I'll just leave it. Oh, some doors. Oh, cool. And just one sec, someone was writing me. I want to just see what they wrote me. Oh, okay, it's just my brother writing to me. Okay. Sorry about that, guys. Let me see. Oh, a, a lever? Huh? Doesn't do anything. I see. Oh, uh, that's an Iron Maiden right there. Okay. Wait, what's this? This lever didn't... Okay. Well, whatever. Oh, weird. Um, oh, and another Iron Maiden. No! Maybe if I mash the buttons, I can get out of this alive. Yup. Alright, I have an idea. Maybe I can pull her a bit over here. Yup. Wow, look at that. That does way more damage because um, I'm hitting her stomach. Oh, shit. Come on. There we go. A little bit cheesy, but, you know, this was a dangerous situation anyways. Oh, shit, she... Oh, wow, she just, like, immediately... ...saw me. Holy crap. It's scripted, then. Oh, no! Just then my buff wore off. 
She has her door open. What? Oh. Ow. Oh, fuck. Quickly. There we go. Ooh, that was close. So, let's first check the hallway, and then I'll check what's in that courtyard. Damn. Oh, an item back there. Two Iron Maidens back to back. Somber Six. I guess you could also just run away from them or run past them, whatever. Because they are quite tough. Just don't miss out on the items. Here's one. <sighs> just a useless butterfly. And what's over here? Stormhawk axe. Cool. Nineteen fifteen. Thunderstorm. Imbue the arm and swing blade. Blah blah blah. Cool. This looks kind of like Nefeli's weapon. I wouldn't be surprised actually if it isn't. She also has, like, an axe that does lightning and stuff, so... Who knows? Elevator. I think this is the elevator that takes you to... Where you could actually warp in here from some, um... What's it called? Teleport thing. I think there's a bonfire up there. Let's find out. Oh crap, my phone is not charging. <laughs> yep. Okay, cool. We need 52, roughly, to level up. I'm gonna get that from the next bosses anyways. There's these really high-level bosses coming up. Oh, I think I, I was here and I killed this giant, right? Yep. Let's take a quick look where this teleports us now that this thing is active. We could get a rough idea by seeing where the beams go, right? Like this. And then hit select. So it either takes us somewhere all the way over here or it's going to take us somewhere all the way back there. I'm not sure. Let's just try it out. Where will it take us? Hmm. Sorry. Oh, all the way down here. Okay. Well, sort of the opposite way, but... Tightly blocked shut. Uh, you must kill probably the bosses in in the plateau and then come back here. But uh, good that we found this. So this was at. Oh shit! Now I don't even know the name of the bonfire. Maybe this one, or th uh, maybe this one, Divine Bridge. I don't know. Whatever. Um, I'm gonna teleport back here. We want to actually now probably climb up the tree and. Yeah, fight these, uh, these guys. There's a golden seed tree there. So I went down already, I think. The Vault of Grand Sacks. Like, look at the size of that. That's the actual, like, giant model version of it. Actually, we don't even need to aggravate this guy. Maybe, But maybe he does give us something, so... Check this out. Oops. One more, maybe. Yeah. Easy peasy. Gargoyle Halberd. Yep. So he was sort of like a mini boss. Oh, you little asshole. 
Okay, one shot at him. Golden Seed. Let's see what's also down here. I think this is where this assassin guy is. Yep, here he is. Okay. Pretty easy. Smithing stone. Oh, and I'm back down here. There's a dog running around. This was where this archers and stuff were. Yeah, okay. There's a couple of dogs. Nothing too threatening, I think. Bark, bark, dead. Some items down here. Okay, cool. How do I get that one? I love this whole area. It's crazy. This this capital, I mean. You can clearly see that something came through here like a like a sandstorm, I guess, or something similar like a sandstorm because everything is covered obviously in this kind of ash or sand. An ash storm? I I I don't know. But yeah, probably it killed a lot of the inhabitants because there's so many guys who are just like dead lying around. All right, so that way leads to the Colosseum, which is also pretty cool, but there's no bonfire over there, so there's no real point. And yeah, this is the way to the next boss and bonfire. Colosseum is totally optional just for PvP. Oh, they, they're easy. You can just one-shot them. Before I go down, I think I'll kill these ones just to make my life easier. Whoa, two times got the same item, Guardian Sword Spear. Cool. Actually, how does that... I've never even really seen that one, I think. Or I haven't used it, at least. Oh, wow. It is. It swings like a sword. What's the R2? Okay. Wow, very slow. And then one-handed? Ah, same thing. Okay. Okay, we can go down here just to see what's... What's up? Look at this cute orange tree. Oops. Let me grab that powder or whatever. dark down here. I can't see. I don't want to fall off the edge. For real though, like, I think that the lantern is, like, one of the best purchases you can make in the game of buying items, you know? It's just so good. I mean, if you're one-handed, like a wizard, or you're just using a one-handed sword in the right hand, you can also just use a torch. But, yeah, for characters like mine, who uses, like, a, a two-handed sword, it really is great. It's awesome. Okay, so there's not really anything down here. Yeah, okay, let's go back up the tree. This orange tree here looks so cool. I don't know why. It's like, it looks like it's bouncing. <laughs> bouncing in the wind. some music to it. Looks like it's vibing, you know, like... <laughs> anyway. Up we go here. Yeah, that's true. <sighs> run, run, run. 
run some more of these tree guys. Ow. Oh wow, this could get dangerous. Something over there. Let me just double check. I killed them all. Nope, there's one here. Yep, that's the boss. So I think I'm I have enough potions and stuff. I'm I'm pretty confident I'll beat him. Even if not, it's not. I could just run past all these enemies next time. And oh man, it's just a sign. Weak foe ahead. Where? Oh. Holy grease. Oh. Wait, what? Why? Not here. Great. Was this just a waste of time? Yeah, okay. Whatever. Oh, Elden Ring. And by the way, look at look how close we are now to the tree. Marvelous. When you see it from a distance, it looks almost like it's like a like a ghost tree, you know, like see-through or something. But it actually, it is not. It's like a real tree. You can go in it. Spoiler, spoiler. Okay, here we go. This is a boss right here. This is um. Oh, there's a statue of America right here. Okay, fine. Okay, I think I will beat him. He does this axe thing, yep. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. I have to be a little bit careful. Oh, you can even, uh... He's just a ghost, but you can even, like, stun him. Oh, he's still alive? Oh, no, he's dead. Ah, that's where you get the last talisman. Nice. I was wondering when I would get that. <laughs> so. That's awesome. Now I finally got it. Um, These are also very good, but... Obviously situational, but, yeah. Maybe this one? I do a lot of charge attacks, so... Oh, shit. Now I'm heavy loaded. Mm. Or then, do we have this... No. Well, I mean, I guess I could probably level up endurance a tiny bit. Because we need endurance anyways at some point. So long as I can medium roll. Let me see if got like a hundred thousand now I could probably level up twice if I use some um what's it called extra runes ten and two nice so twelve let me see let's first try just one let's see if I can medium roll oh I'm already medium again just from that from one point so I'll just keep going then into um into intelligence, I guess. Oh, that only gives you one point, though. That sucks. Let's do endurance. I'll get endurance up to, like, 20-ish. More stamina is also good for more attacks, more swings, right? Uh, wait a second. Which door did I come in from? This one? Oh, yeah, there's the guy sitting there in the tree. So let's... Before I go... I know that this, this is the way to go up to the next boss, which is, I think, 
Gideon, right? But I want to see what else is here. <laughs> Could this be a treasure chest? Would have fooled me. It's funny that there's just water there. You can just jump in it and kill yourself. Oh, how interesting. Oh, it's a shortcut? Let me see. Yeah, I think so, because there's a, a lever here. I just need to send this down, I guess. Cool. Where am I exactly? Oh, I know where... Okay, yep, I know exactly this door. Yep, cool, cool. Hmm, maybe... Maybe there's items down there, though. Ah, whatever. I don't need it. Then there's, like, a tree here. Oh, there's an invisible wall. No, okay, you can actually climb up this. On this side. Okay, this just leads you back. Yeah, there's no point to really go over here. This will just lead you back down. And no item here. Next is very windy tree. It's weird because these trees are moving so much, but the branches of the big tree above are barely moving, which they should have kind of... I, in my opinion, because it's like the same wind, right? They should have made... Like, look, look how shaky this tree looks. And then, like, look at this tree right behind it. And then this one with the branches is also moving super slow. Like, whoa. I don't get why do they make some trees move faster than the others. That just, to me, doesn't make any sense. But little details, you know. I'm just being nitpicky. Okay, so we came in from there. There's nothing over there. We just went that way. So this is the way to the next boss. We leveled up, like, twice. Man. That boss gave us like 100k, I think. It's strange that they give you so much like holy grease, and I think, uh. I think these bosses here are like holy elemental, so they're not gonna be. affected by holy grease, I think. Or it could be that just the end bosses, I don't know. Holy Grease is probably good for, like, the undead creatures, like skeletons and stuff. And zombies. Okay, the next boss is Gideon, and he's pretty easy if you just rush him down and beat the crap out of him. Or is it Gideon? Yeah, I think it's Gideon. I don't know. Oh, shit, there's an item up there. Wait, what the hell? I think this guy had the same idea like me. Wait, what? Maybe you can drop down from above. Yeah, it has to be. Ah. Check this out. There's a roof here. Oh, interesting. Ah, yep, and you can go back this way. Oh, there's a chest there. Whew, let's run over and check what's inside. Hopefully something cool. The air tree bow. Nice. Kick the ladder. Celestial dew. Did it go all the way down? Yeah, okay. Uh Oh, this is the boss arena. Wait, what? Weird. Air tree bow. Ah. But could just pick it up like that. I guess he probably just reaches out with his hand. 
and grabs it. Nice. I don't know what that was. I think it was also like a prayer book you can give to the turtle pope. And, um, yeah. Ah, oh, here's a nice little trap for noobs. You see that? Where I'm locked on? That's like a black knife assassin. He tries to always stab you in the back. He's actually not very hard. But if he does stab you in the back, it's going to do a lot of damage. So, the best is if you also just rush and beat the crap out of him. You see? There you go. And that was just quick R2s for my weapon. Okay, another bonfire, another item. I think it's a spell. Blessing of the Earth Tree. Nice, nice, nice. Before I continue, I think I will just quickly go to the Turtle Pope. Just to turn in all of these, um... These books. Muriel. Ah, his name is Muriel. Muriel. Okay, cool. Greetings. Give a scroll. Oh, what very well. That heresy is all thing. Oh, what very well. Heresy is not all thing. Oh, what very well. Heresy all thing. Oh, very well. Heresy all thing. Oh, very well. Heresy all thing. Do you con then I will concerning Radigan repented the order this mirror and so to restore. So, what did we unlock here? Oh, this is also really good. Black Flame Blade. But it doesn't work on somber weapons, I think. So, yeah, it's good for faith builds, like if you're doing fire. Nord heal. Only 20 faith, but 55 FP cost. Oh my god. Expensive. Alleviates poison, blood, lost sleep, blah, 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 whatever. Uh-huh. This is a pretty good spell. Also pretty good. Okay, back to the tree. Um, I think it's this one. The Queen's Bed Chamber. So the Queen is, of course, probably Marika, right? Queen Marika, the one who was cheated on by Radagon or whatever else. Oh, no, wait. Marika's the mother or... Beca because Renala was the wife of Radagon, right? And they have Rani. Oh, man, I don't know. I don't know the story. This game is so confusing. Oh, so it wasn't Gideon. Gideon comes later. Yeah, that's, that's right, when I come back here. Oh, what's interesting is... I think this is the only fight where you can summon in... Melania. I could be wrong, but I think this is the only one that I ever found. Melina, I mean. Melina. So, I'm going to do it. She doesn't really help me, though. I'm going to, anyways, beat him down by myself. But, yeah, why not? You can see how she fights. She has, like, a little dagger. No, 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 over here, dummy. And, anyways, it's the same boss, like, at the beginning of the game. This, uh... What's his face? Margit. Morgoth this time. But he has a sword. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Oh, shit. Whoop. It's kind of far away. I think I missed. Yep. 
See, she didn't really do much. No! It's kind of like in the game, this is almost like your girlfriend or something. Okay, cool. We killed him. Easy peasy. Oh, man, look how much souls he gave. Like, 93,000. Damn. So, let's go over here. And now, when you go back, there's a bonfire, I think. Yeah. And you can talk to Melina. Melina? Melina? Whatever. And she's like, oh, you gotta take me to the volcano. Let's sit and level up. There she is. Hello again, old friend. She friendzoned us. Nice. Shall I turn your wounds to strength? Let my share them with me. So, yeah, I was gonna put a little bit more into endurance. Also, this one. Do I have? Temporarily boost charge attack power, boost magic attacks. Actually, these are pretty good. But I think I also have, like, this thing that restores HP over time, right? Let me see. What? Ah, these can... You can you, <laughs> you can make a full heal potion if you put both of these in, I guess. Yeah, this one's also really good. Mm, but I do like the damage. So once I get to like 80 intelligence or close, or like let's say even just 60 or something, I can remove this one. Because then you hit anyways the cap. The hard cap. Oh damn, wait, how much do I need to level up? 56? Oh, it's almost 20,000 souls. A little bit less. Yeah, it's like 19,000 something. Or 18,000. Let's see if I have... I could use these two. Alright, five of these. I could use three of these. Yeah, why not? That should give me enough. Let's see now. Yup. Just over. And then we're going to go for intelligence, even if it gives you just one point, whatever. So here's the rolled. We can go to the mountaintop soon. Or even now. Um. Oh yeah, I wanted to check out this tower. Now maybe I can go in this tower. So where was the... Uh, the warping thing? Perhaps this one? I'd like to check the Divine Towers because they give you a new rune at the top, you know? Yep, it was this one. I mean, I'm kind of happy... I don't, did I even... I don't even use... I only have 16 of them. So I should use it when I fight hard bosses, but... Yeah, whatever. I could use one, I guess. But... It's kind of a waste if you die. It's the same as being embered, you know, in Dark Souls 1 and 3. 2 didn't have that, I think. Oh, shit. Okay. Hmm. That is strange. I thought if you kill them... Okay, well. Maybe something else is blocking this. Oh, well, whatever. Um, What should I do next? I don't... This is low-level area for me now. This is also technically low-level. Oh! Oh, yeah, we could do... Th Let's do this real quick. Kill those dudes. I like doing these assassination missions, you know? You kill them and then you go back. It's kind of like PvP almost. Um, I'm going to actually put the thing on top of it. Bambi! Couple of wolves, who cares? A snake thingy. Okay, and here somewhere is a red sign. Yep, perfect. I wish they put a stake of America near here, but that's fine. 
So when you invade, you have like less potions, less everything. So you have to be kind of good at killing. All right, let's see if we can do this. Yeah. Oh, he's very easy. Oh, nice. Very easy. Now I can warp to the Volcano Manor and get the next one. Cool. Hey, give me his armor. <laughs> you probably murder him and then he drops his armor, you know? Uh, Volcano Manor. I have to talk to... Tanith, or what's her name? Where is she? Oh man, why don't they just show her on the map? I think it's this one. Oh, she's gone. Um, okay, maybe not her, maybe one of her servants. Let me check. It's probably this guy in the chair. Oh no, he's gone too. Oh. Magma shot. Cool, I guess. Oh, maybe you were so... Ah, oh, damn it, I could have screwed myself over. Because I remember there was more um, missions, right? There was like a couple of assassination missions, but maybe because I killed Rykard, this lord, the snake, you know, the snake lord... They all just leave? Okay, this is weird. You can still learn skills, though, even though this guy's gone. Sword of Bern Bernal. Yo, that definitely is a Twihander. That looks like a Twihander. I don't know. Oh, okay, so I guess... Yeah, I sort of screwed up the Volcano Manor. Oh well, I guess there's no more assassination missions. But they're anyways very easy, and they just, you know, give you some armor or whatever. Um, yeah, this is our next destination, so I need to go to... Here? Oh, wait. Actually, I think it's faster from the... Oh, let me try this one. I think it's faster from the Avenue Balcony. Let me just double check. Yeah, no, it's fa it's faster from the other one. I'm pretty sure. Because you can just jump down and then, you know, run to run. Not even jump down. You just run all the way back where the. Yep, this way. There's no jumping actually. Yeah. Oh. You have to be kind of careful. If you don't get the bolt of Grand Sacks now. And it's very important, you know? Like, if you don't get the Bolt of Grand Sacks now, and then you kill the Fire Giant and throw Melina into the... into the volcano, practically, you never can get the Bolt of Grand Sacks in that file. So you have to be very careful. Looks like some... I oh, I might have missed some items back there. Let me just quickly go check. I heard him get up. Oh, he's just going back down. It's very dark here. Two of these guys. These are like the lowest foot soldiers. Imp head. Uh, huh? Maybe there's a way up there. Let me check over this way. Oh fuck, there's a knight. Maybe I can... Okay, it's much easier now.
So, there might be some stairs. I just missed that one item, which is no big deal. I can quickly grab it. There's another knight here. Yep, the one just chilling, sort of. Maybe we can sneak up behind him. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, well. Actually, don't want to fight now all these guys. Oh, shit. He's... Oh, wow. His accuracy is pretty good. Oh, well. Let's just leave it. I don't know how to get over there easily, so... That's fine. We'll just leave it then. So I'm, I'm going to just be wasting time figuring out how to get, like, some... Probably low-level item that I don't even care about. From some balcony over there, whatever. Uh, I'm good with my sword. So I'm just going to keep going. There's also some items down here. There's dogs and... These werewolf guys jumping around. Yeah. Oh, they're actually pretty easy. Wow, 15, 20, 15, 19, whatever. Pretty good damage for the beam attack. Just like one-shotting everything now. Hopefully the giant... I don't actually remember, but I think he is also frostbiteable. When I did the... the mage, you know, the... the ice mage challenge. I think he was frostbiteable. So that's good, because then I can also kill him probably with the sword. Pretty sneaky here. Oh. Oh boy. Okay. He anyways just goes down with one hit. Whoa. That's a non-charged attack. 1480. Just a normal regular R2. So powerful. <laughs> the dog's just chilling. Perfume bottle. Mikola. Millennia Blade of Mikola. Oh, and by the way, yes, definitely I will do that. If I have to Google where the other half of this... this key thing is, then I will. But I will definitely fight Millennia at some point. Probably also just with my sword here. She's not too bad, if you know her pattern. But yeah, she's technically the hardest boss in the game because of her waterfowl dance. Which can um, totally wreck your build. It doesn't matter what you play as, it's going to hit you pretty hard. But in theory, if you um, have a great shield with, you know, the great shield talisman and all that, you can just tank. Sleepy heads. There's one guy here praying. Please. 
please forgive me my sins. Okay, I will forgive you. Go to your god. <laughs> You can actually hear them snoring, which is good. Oh, we got another guy praying here. Oh, he's just like the boss. That one boss that I had such a hard time with. Uh-oh. You done fucked up. Oh, this guy. Oh. I'm actually most concerned about this one throwing shit at me. Come on, come down a bit. Yep, that's good. There we go. So, like, really, they're all praying to something. Praying for the dead. But I don't see that. What I see is free runes. If only I had a seed. Huh? Oh, he's like praying or what? Okay, that's pretty easy. They give pretty good experience. Like good, uh, you know, runes. I mean, it's not too bad. All right, this is the lift that takes you up to the mountain tops, or it's coming up. Up we go. It's covered in blood from head to toe, like a true butcher. Even the sword is covered in blood. Oh, that's funny. You go outside in the rain and look, it washes off. Well, you can see this little asshole. Oh. I heard the shot of a crossbow, so I was like, huh? Bonfire. Damn. Well, if I die here, I'm just going to run through all the crazy shit and just come back here. This is a great bow guy, right? Yeah. Oh, and one on the horse. Maybe I killed the horse. Nope. Well. Worked out in the end. Where is the beetle? Oh, here he is. Oh no. What the hell?
I think it didn't even do damage. Like, when it hit me with its ball, I went flying backwards. But I didn't take any damage, I think. So that's okay. Funny. It transformed into a giant beetle. Oh, and yeah, that's true. This, <laughs> if I remember this correctly, um, if you have like, like normally you need like the thing to go into the mountaintops of the giants, right? But there is a way to sort of skip this entire thing. And it involves, let me just double check. I don't want to talk shit. Oh no, it is, it is this one. Yeah, I think this is the one. It involves you like, you need a certain weapon. Or some kind of setup that like launches you, like you, you do a stab or something or some kind of special attack and it launches you and you land actually on top of that fence. And then you can sort of just run along this fence, I think, and walk along the edge of the tower and jump around like th these, these things sticking out. If I remember correctly, and you can sort of skip your way to the mountaintop so you don't have to actually fight all the bosses, you could just... Because at some point, like, if you go around the tower, I think it's considered you're inside the mountaintops. And you could do a quit out, and then when you load back in, you're on top of the mountains or something weird like that. Mountaintop skip. I don't know exactly. I don't know exactly, but it was something like that. Okay, down we go. Or maybe it's maybe it's not actually here, but like once you get to that lift where you have to use the medallion. But yeah, whatever. It's all the same. I'm gonna quickly rest here. Okay. Probably, like, now that I think about it, like, and you look at this map, I probably missed a lot of caves, a lot of places to explore, you know? I think I got, like, a lot of, like, here, here, for example, that's a cave, right? I probably missed, there might be a cave here, so I might have to actually go back, and also this entire thing, I didn't think I visited this, this castle with this green water. I do remember that there was a castle that had this poison water, and I'm guessing that's this one right here. There's probably something there. Look, there's some ships. With people actually on the ships. This might have to do with the DLC. But yeah, I think I'm missing a bit here and there. It's not the end of the world, but yeah, it would have been cool to see like more caves and more... Places, but yeah, now I'm so high level that I should just probably just continue the game. Okay, anyway, enough about that. Let me zoom in here. Okay, I'm just gonna follow this road, and at some point, you probably will get this map. You know? All these little assholes. There might be items here, too. But if I remember correctly, there wasn't any, like, caves or anything major. So I think I'll just keep going. If I see items, I'll grab them, but, yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, man. Freaking poison plant. I didn't even know that was... Oh, yeah, okay, whatever. Oh, there's a beetle. I think he's a red beetle, though. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Take it easy there, little guys. Yeah. Oh, another seed. Awesome. Excellent. A blue one, which I don't really need right now. And I think there's a bonfire actually here. Somewhere. Or maybe not. 
Or or maybe the bonfire is after this guy, like just up the stairs. I actually don't want to fight him right now. I'm gonna go look first for the bonfire. Statue of America though, so if I die it's not the end of the world, but it's not so cool to fight him if you're poisoned, right? Okay. Or maybe... The poison is, like, so slow. It doesn't really matter. Oh, shit. Ow. Okay, he does a lot. Oh, shit. Let me heal up real quick. Oh, shit. He does. He hits really heavy. Okay. It was good that I did a quick R2 there. Better to get a riposte than, you know, to get hit and then lose the chance to do a riposte. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Oh, wow. Two weapons plus 93,000 souls. So, yep, now I can rest and level up. Yep, okay. Maybe get in endurance a little bit more. Yeah. And... There we go. One of these will... Yep, this one will take us up. Wow. Come a long way. Sweet deal. I can ride the horse. Uh, da, 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 da. Riding along, riding along. Mountaintops of the giants. Yep. Oh, this th actually this might have been the where the place where you could somehow skip to the mountaintops. I forget how it actually is, but whatever. Oh, you can't hit Bambi. What's cool is now. Oh, you could see the mountain path that we went. So even if I missed some items, I don't think I really missed any caves. Maybe there's a cave here, but I don't know. Mountain Tops of the Giants is pretty big. Yeah. Alright. And... Oh, I already... At the beginning of the game, remember I got... I killed this guy. Oh, wait, he's back? I thought I killed this guy to get his katana. That's what I had before the Moonblade, but let me see what he says. Shut up. Let me see if I can kill him. Oh, oh no. Oh my shit. Holy crap, he almost killed me. Oh, he grabbed me again? <laughs> Man, he grabbed me twice. This bastard. Okay, next time I will beam him. The grab attack is doing so much damage, it nearly killed me right then and there. Oh, shit. Yep, perfect. Oh, not good. It's really pulley. going to kill himself in the end. I should actually kill all the NPCs I can. Oh, nice. May Chaos take the world.
<laughs> awesome hat. But I like still the bucket helmet better. Whoops. What did he drop? Also some kind of Ronin. Oh, I could actually wear them. Where were the... this one? Oh man, I can even wear these too. Somehow it looks kind of like it fits to the armor a bit. Looks cool, right? Oh man, I really like those. Yeah. But there's no protection in the back, but in the front, so... Yeah. Looks cool. Like a leather glove, and then a metal gaunt gauntlet. Okay, here's some ruins. We can explore them. They might actually go down as well. I don't like fighting these guys. They're very annoying because they dodge a lot. They're not very difficult. They just dodge so much that it's like not fun fighting them. And here's like this ice spell that I used on the ice mage, obviously. The Zamur... Um, Ice Storm. It's here somewhere on a body. I forget where it was exactly. Maybe up here somewhere. There it is. Zammer Ice Storm. And there's no stairs going down. I guess. Okay, that's fine. I think the problem is that a lot of the NPCs now are at that round table, so I can't kill them all. Oh shit, the stupid birds! Whoa, those two birds took off half my health. He's pointing to, I think, a cave. Let's see what he said again. Oh, I can't read it again. Okay, fine. I'll just follow it and see if it's taking me to some cave. Where's that beam of light? It's very hard to see it. Oh, okay, up there somewhere. I love this area, though. Like, the whole... How it looks and everything, you know? It's so pretty, like... These nice mountains where you'd want to go hiking or snowboarding or something. Alright. Let's see here. Whoop. <laughs> is it this way? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. This is the way. This is the way. And there's a cave, I think, directly below me here. Which is good because it. Not only is it a cave, but it also is like a bonfire, right? So. Just in case I die. Giant mountaintop catacombs. Ooh. Probably around 60. Yeah, almost 60k. You need 58 something. Um. Oh, she's still alive. Yeah. There is something I. My purpose was given to me now. I have set my heart regardless. I won't allow any, not even. Okay, I didn't even say anything. <laughs> She's just being nuts. Is there anything? Oh, there's a little guy. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. I should always attack.
Okay, well, sneaky little devils. And an elevator. Mm -hmm. uh, not sure if there's anything. No, it doesn't look like there's anything below. There might be another elevator, though. Oh, oh I missed it. But actually, ah, see, here's the door. Wait, this is actually perfect. Okay, there's nothing here anyways, so fine. It looks like there's another elevator that goes all the way down. Yep. Mm -hmm. And over here. Dead end. Might have to be going downstairs. <laughs> Little pottery guys chucking pots at me. Okay. Oh, another elevator going down. Hmm. Suspicious. Yeah. Below here, nothing. Death. So let's bring it back down in a second. Okay. And I think I see the switch. I could just run ahead, but then those little wolf dudes are gonna probably just spawn. Or these pots. Yeah, it's better to kill them one by one. So you don't get, like, ganged up on. Oh, shit. The big daddy. Oh, he can't go through. Hmm? There we go. Oh, this is not a lever. I thought this would be a lever because of the statue. Okay. So it's just a waste of time, or what the hell? There's an upstairs here. Oh, okay. Maybe it's this way still. What the fuck? Ice arrows. Wow. Oh. Okay. Well, I thought there was a ball for some reason. It's just these cleaver knife things. Oh, whoa. Holy crap. Okay, suicidals. Oh, shit. Two more right here. This is a weird dungeon, to be honest. Okay, now these things that make poison? Yep. Check this out. Oh no, it's too late. Oh shit, no, 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 no. Oh, and I'm actually taking damage from that. Shit. You can knock them over and then... Poke them in their tender under roots. Just 
It's only worth 200. See ya! Okay, they didn't drop anything. Come on. Kill those pots. There's a door here. Here. Yeah, in a second. Oh, big guy. Oh, wow, no defense. No magic defense. <laughs> so easy. Plop. Nascent butterfly. Wait, so... There's no lever up here either. A lever. Lever, lever, whatever. So, wait, what? Yo, I'm so confused about this. Oh. Maybe behind this statue... Damn, I rolled too early. Ah. A hidden path. Wait, what? <laughs> what? It just loops back? Oh, man. Maybe I'm supposed to take that elevator below. I think this this was just all like a waste of time this way. So, that's okay. I'll go back to the other room with the elevator. And oh wait, what? Now there's a okay, I must have missed this last time. These also usually have no defense to magic. Oh shit. Yo, what the hell? Where did this little guy come from? No. Oh, shit. What? I, I thought I killed everything in here. Oh, man. No. What is this bullshit? Oh, my God. I'm so confused. Okay. Let's go get my souls. What the fuck? Just gonna run past. thousand souls, whatever. Wait, what? Where's the elevator? My souls are back that way. Okay. these 
potheads alone. Oh, weird. There's no exploding jars now. Huh? And a big pot. Wait, what? Ah, uh, is this one of those... I guess this is one of those dungeons that tries to trick you, you know? Oh. Because everything looks so familiar. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, and see, this room looks like the other room, but this one has this exploding pots here. So it's all just bullshit. It's all just a trap. Yeah, and now there's going to be an elevator here somewhere. Oh, there's even... Oh, wait a minute. Let me call the elevator back because, okay, I see that there's this guy down there, but I want my souls from that cat and those little tricky bastards. Oh, interesting. There's a jar down there. Probably some items. That might actually be the right way to go. But yeah, whatever. Let's first go up. So, I should not get this cat's attention before I kill everything in this room. But where were these little freaks? Here's one. Okay. Here's one. Then it'll be much easier because nothing's gonna stab me in the back. Okay, I got my souls now. Uh, where's the last one? Fuck, there was three of them. Ah, oh, shit. I don't know where the last one is, but okay, whatever. Ah. Uh, there he is. Come on. Drop down, you asshole. There we go. Okay, good. Quickly. Oh, fuck. Oh, and he's doing ice magic? Close one. There we go. The fuck? And still no lever. I can even put that here on the ground since no one else did. <laughs> Look, still no le lever, lever. <laughs> Maybe I can help somebody here, though, because, um, can I actually survive? I don't know, I'm not going to risk it. I'll just send it up. Oh, other people already put message. Probably says, like, try down. I'm guessing. Leave head, but down, yeah. Try down. Yep. Good. I'm gonna buff this. Maybe I can even hit this guy here. No. Oh, shit. Oh, wow, one-shotted. Damn. That was powerful. Oh, there's something even below this, but this looks like if I jump down there, I'm not going to be able to get back up. Lever ahead, yeah, so maybe I should first 
do this. Yep, I see it. Good. First, the lever. That's the most important. <sighs> yep. Nice! Got the big boy. So let's go check out this other room real quick. It probably just leads to this one. Yeah, okay. Yep, I see what... Little pots. Now what? Ah, uh, okay, I know where we are. Let me just check. Yep, where those things are. Okay, cool. So then, to get back... I think it's this way. Well, 71,000. Oh, shit, I hope I don't die. Now we pulled the lever. But actually, now I'm wondering where was the door? Because I don't really remember where the door was. I think it was below. Oh, shit. Ah, here's the door. Well, if there's a statue of America, then I can just go here. Oh, shit, there isn't. Okay, uh, then let me go back a bit. Hopefully the bonfire's just here, uh, up here somewhere. Ah, the bon- mm, Okay, the bonfire is just above, so, okay, okay, okay. Take the elevator down and, yeah. <sighs> man, but now I don't have this potion here, Flask of Wonders Physic, but, yeah, it should be okay. Let's see what they make us fight. What is it? Oh, great. One of these. And he hits like a truck, of course. Quickly. Oh, shit. He was so fast, he didn't even let me do a quick one. Oh, I couldn't roll. Damn it. He's hard. Fuck. I hate... I, it's hard to time what this guy does. Because he's so fucking big. In there? Oh no! I'm dead. Yep. Ah! This would have been good if there was a statue of America right outside of the boss door. <laughs> but okay. I think I know where I have to go. I have to take this elevator down. Practically right here. Just ignore all these little guys. Yep. Okay. Man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. Oh, in fact, we can send back up. Oh, 
Okay, maybe this time we'll go a little bit better because I have three minutes with this buff. Okay, oh shit, I can't. I'm so close to my... Yes, thing. No, that was a bad time to heal. Oh my god. Wow. Okay, I dodged this time. Oh man. Boss has no chill. One more. Come on. There we go. Oh my god, like... <laughs> he doesn't have much defense either, but... He's just so crazy how fast he moves and stuff. Whoa. I can almost level up twice, I think. Death route. Okay. Let's get the hell out of here. I think I can level up twice because it's like less than 60. So. Where's the bonfire? Just here. We're very close to probably two level ups. We'll see now. Nope, exactly two. Yep, I'll just get this to 20. It's three more level ups, that's enough then. Oh, there's an item right here. Well, pick it up, come on. Okay. Oh wow, he has a lot of HP actually. Oh shit. No, no. Damn. <laughs> There's a statue of America though, it shows the symbol, so whatever. Stake of America. Hmm. I could kill this guy, I just need to probably buff first. Where was he? Or maybe I can sneak up behind these ones. Ice first fire kind of thing. Look. Uh oh, did I wake up the others? As long as I didn't wake up the fat guy. Save him for a second. Oh, now he's waking up. Yeah. 
He didn't even drop anything? What a ripoff. It's like the Great Wall of China right here. Oh, and there's an archer. Yep, I think he saw me. Have to be a little bit careful. Nice. You can use sort of the terrain here. Or just be fast. The horse took a lot of damage, but I was totally fine. Oh wow, they have a lot of HP. Oh, <laughs> 14,000? Holy crap. Critical, critical hit. Sick. Yeah, give me the item. Okay, there we go. That was pretty crazy. Ooh, somber eight. It's funny that you can get all these somber stones though also in Kaled. Like the nine the level nine one I think is in Kaled. The eight one I think was also in Kaled. Seven was in the Volcano Manor. Five was also in the Volcano Manor or um Altus, and then one through four. Super easy to get. Yeah, five was... Five, now I have a good location for five, which is... Uh, if you guys remember, there was this forest with all these guys spitting death blight stuff. Where was that? I think it was here, right? Somewhere. No. Uh, well, somewhere there's... There's that forest with all those guys spitting death blight near the windmill place. Oh yeah, it was this forest. In here, there's a five, so it's pretty good. Somber smithing stone five. And then one through four you can just buy from EG. He sells it right away. Or you just find them anyways. They're so easy to find in the beginning areas of the game. It's kind of like, I mean, you can, of course, uh, use a somber weapon right away, or you can just, you know, use normal smithing stones until you do find the somber weapon that you want to use. Like me here with this dark moon um, blade. I I didn't use any potions, I'm good. I don't need to rest. Not yet. Ah, there's a dragon here that you can kill. On this big lake. Coming up. I might skip him though. Because I don't really need to kill him. And I think he's also an ice dragon as well. So my weapon won't do as much damage. Dragons are good to take down with lightning. Oh here's a guy. Let's kill this guy. Wow. Oh shit. Quickly. Come on. Yup. Let's see, 14? <laughs> what the hell? Oh. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. So yeah, wait. The dragon is over here. I want to see what's over here first real quick. We're getting close to the... The last giant, whatever he's called. 
Oh, but I might actually... I, I can kill the giant, no problem. But I might not sacrifice Melina because I have to do some research with the Dung Eater and all that. I wanted to get his ending. So, I might actually even stop then there. If I kill the giant or just getting to the giant. I don't know. We could try fighting him, but... Okay, there's just a shack all the way out here. Not much else going on. Some ice trees or ghost trees. They look actually... Like, why... Why are they, like, floating, you know? Like, <laughs> what kind of weird-ass trees are these? Ghost trees. What the hell is this? Warming stone. Meat. It's like a pile of giants and their weapons. Smithing stone seven. Another reason why I hate the standard weapons is because they go all the way up to plus 25. So you need stones 1 through 8, I believe. And then, of course, an ancient um, smithing stone as well. And they're actually... Those stones are harder, I think, to find than somber ones. So to me, it seems like the game kind of wants you to use a somber weapon, but... Yeah, you can, of course, use standard weapons as well. I just don't like standard weapons. They're so boring, you know? They don't have a cool Ash of War or unique Ash of War. You can only put, like, the default ones on them. I mean, some of the default Ashes of War are very good and useful, but... At the same time, the Ashes of War on somber weapons are unique to the weapon itself, and... Usually they're more powerful. Let me see if I can also get this guy. Quickly. Oh, shit. He, he went out of the way. What? There we go. Stupid ice giant. Why can I not hit him? Oh. There we go. Whatever. He's dead now. I oh, was guarding this. Yeah. Okay. So yeah. If you guys are watching and you hear me talking some stuff, comment below what your favorite weapon is. I'm always curious what other people like. To me personally, I think the somber weapons are the best. Oh shit, come on. <laughs> Smacked in the face. There we go. Some quick R1s. Okay. So I think up here is the lake. Or let me see. Yeah, 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 yeah. And a bonfire. I need 61. So exactly... Wait, whoops. 6159. Oh, almost exactly 20,000. A little bit less, but whatever. Let's just give... Do I have a 20,000 here? Oh, okay. I could just use these two. Boom. 20,000. Level up again. And yeah, like I said, I'm probably just going to skip the, the dragon. There's no real reason to fight him. Unless you are, like, making a dragon build. Wait, what? I'm off by 200 or something. Oh shit, I'm off by 200 
and two. So that means I have to use a 400. It's fine. Endurance is starting to look good, too. Look at the bar. It's getting there. And... Oh, I have three... How many... S I couldn't level up my flask? Wait, did I miss that? Sometimes you need three, sometimes you need four. Five! Oh, wow. Oh, okay, okay. I think there is, like, a total of 14 flasks in the game. So... That means... I pretty much found almost all the seeds already. There's just a few that are missing, but yeah. Wait, so if I need two more, most likely that will put me at 13 flasks. And I think if it is if it is 14 total, that means then I'm missing five more to get to 14, which means there are seven in the world still all over the place. Oh, here's another dungeon. Oh, this needs two keys, right? Let me see if I have... How many keys do I have? I got like five. Okay, why not? Let's go in. Ooh, scary. Spirit Caller Cave. Ah. Uh, I think I know what this is going to be. There are these snails that can summon as well, like spirits. So you have to actually kill the snail and just ignore the... Like, if there's wolves or whatever else. You could kill them too, I mean, it doesn't really matter. But the goal is to kill the the snail that summons them. And, yeah, you see, there's like, what are those, wolves? And there's a snail right here, so you want to go kill the snail. Come on, don't teleport. And now all the wolves die. Nice. That's exactly, th that's what it's trying to teach you. That's why they showed right now only two wolves and one snail. It, it's kind of showing you like, okay... Don't focus the wolves, because he will just keep creating more. You have to just kill the snail. Which is annoying, but you know. Not the end of the world. Wow, this cave is super dark. Like, look at this. My god, you cannot see anything. I was lucky that he was just there. Made it super easy to kill him. Sometimes it's not the case. See, here's some wolf sleeping. I think that's a wolf too. Maybe I can just sneak past. I don't know how aware these wolves are. I think they're just chilling, so... Oh, shit. They're howling at some shit. Where is the snail? Let me just sneak over here. There she is. There we go. Now all the wolves die. Or half of the wolves die. Oh, there's another snail. I see it back there. Okay, wait. Oh, shit. These wolves are hitting heavy. Quickly, come on. There we go. Nice. Oh, there's still one snail somewhere. Oh, man. Oh, this is just a regular enemy. Yep. Okay. Oh, no, it's not. Shit. There might be still one snail somewhere hiding in the bushes. Oh, cool. Samurai armor. Well, I don't know where the last snail is, so I'm just going to leave it. Damn, they that th those wolves hit really hard. Took off half of my health. 
And I'm at 60, right? So, okay. No statue, so I guess we'll just have to beat it on our first try. Yup, again. This is a trap. Where is the fucking snail? Or maybe this is the snail. Oh man, I missed. Ah! So close. It. Yeah, it just keeps summoning. Oh, fuck. Maybe you have to actually kill them one time. Oh, come on. There we go. Don't let him call them again. Whew. Crazy. Pretty tough fight. Got to admit. 71,000? Oh my god. Oh, my little cat. He's just watching me. Alright. So I'm going to level up. And, yep, let's do it like this. And I think, actually, this is a good place to stop. Because, you know, we're getting close. Just down here somewhere is the giant. We could do that next time. And, yeah, I need to take a break anyway. So, thank you for watching. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.